The FBI scrambling tonight to try and figure out how a man ended up hanging from a tree. 16 WAPT's Ross Adams went to Port Gibson, where the mystery is becoming one of the biggest stories in the country. The community deserves answers, specifically the family deserves answers. But they didn't get many answers from Friday's FBI news conference as investigators did little to tamp down growing speculation about an investigation gaining national attention. A black man hanging from a tree in Mississippi. Everybody's heard rumors, including myself, as to who may be behind this and why. Uh, we're going to hold off and come to any conclusions until really the facts take us as to a definitive answer. Police crime scene tape marks the spot where officers found Otis Bird's body Thursday morning hanging from a tree just outside Port Gibson. The sheriff said Bird's feet were dangling two feet off the ground. I just think it's incomprehensible that something like this happened in 2015. You don't think he took his own life? No. No, I don't think he did. I believe somebody hung. Dude, why would he go into the woods 500 feet away from his home to hang himself? Then he did 25 to 26 years in prison. Nine years ago, the state paroled Bird after he served more than two decades for the 1980 robbery and murder of a white woman. There's no proof that this is what's done, done in any retaliation for anything that happened in 1980. There's no evidence that's pointing towards that. So let's not make this out to be something that it's not. 30 federal and state agents are now working this case. So we're bringing the resources that we need to come to a conclusion uh, wherever that takes us. Our, our biggest interest in Mississippi, anytime you find anyone hanging from a tree, that is not as a result of a racial hate crime. Even though authorities have not said Bird's death is a hate crime, the Black Lives Matter movement now ramping up and planning a protest here at the county courthouse Monday morning. Reporting from Claiborne County, Ross Adams, 16 WAPT News.